uh, hello guys Dan here welcome back to the channel a lot of you guys ask me how I did uh, my basis for my uh, GSA army for the infinity so today uh, I will show you how I actually did it so just uh, sit back relax and enjoy the rest of the video we will only need six paints today so it will be a uh, astro granite a black temple contrast and then you will need uh, some bone color and orange color for the dry brushes as well as some uh, white and the yellow for the road markings uh, just to start uh, i will uh, apply the astro granite uh, all over the base and uh, i will try to make one uh, very thin uh, even coat uh, all over don't go too thick with this uh, so try to apply it uh, very thin but uh, not too thin uh, so you just want to have a uh, even coverage all around so just apply it and then remove the excess and return it to the pot we to dry for a couple of hours and then after that uh, you can just go and apply straight one thick coat of uh, black templar over it and then uh, leave it again to dry properly after everything is dry i will start a dry brushing uh, first i will start with the bone color and i will do a very light uh, dry brush uh, all around the base After I was satisfied with the level of brightness I got my base, uh, I will take the orange color, in this case it is rust, and I will just uh, dry brush the middle of the base uh, just to create a, a, like a spotlight, just a small circle at the middle of the base, as, as well I will do this as a light dry brush. Now it's time to uh, draw the lines uh, and the road signs. So first I will start with the yellow one and I will just take some old brush and I will just keep dabbing the color uh, from the top uh, because you want it to be uh, transparent so it looks like it worn off uh, during the time on the road. And we will do the same thing with the uh, white paint as well. So just put it on your old brush and tap it from the top. Uh, in this case I wanted to create like a, a little uh, one-way road and I will draw an arrow. Uh, you can see on the rest of my bases that I did for my army I did uh, some Japanese uh, signs. So I just Google on the Google Japanese road uh, markings and look at the images and just try to copy some of the Japanese signs. And that's it, this quick job is done, the base is ready to be used, so just find your favorite miniature and put it on top. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this short video, if you did, please uh, leave a like and subscribe to the channel, and uh, hope to see you back uh, soon in the future. Uh, that's it for now, stay safe and uh, bye bye!